Today we are going to be showing you how to troubleshoot fault code 666, CAN bus failure on your JLG telescopic forklift. If your machine is encountering this fault the display is showing a 666 CAN bus failure and the engine cranks but will not start. Possible causes A blown fuse Loose ground connection Corrosion in the fuse holder Or a broken wire or bad splice in the harness. Troubleshooting steps. 1. Check ECM fuses and ground connections. Make sure the fuses have 12 volts. Check the 30 amp fuse in the inline fuse holder in the black box under the radiator. Note, the fuse may look and test good but may be bad. Check the F18 fuse in the cab fuse slash relay panel. Remove and clean the ECM ground on the side of the engine block beside the fuel filter. 2. If ECM fuses and ground is good but the 666 code is still on. Remove the J2 connector from the ECM to test power and ground through the harness to the ECM. Power from the 30 amp ECM fuse will be on pins 1, 25, 26, 27 and 28. Power from the F18 fuse will be on pin 5. Note the key switch has to be in the on position to see power on this pin. Engine block ground in on pins 49, 50, 51, 52 and 73. 3. If there is not power or ground on the correct pins. Then the harness will need to be tested for broken wires or bad splices. 4. If there is power and ground to the correct pins, the ECM will need to be tested by Cummins or replaced. Thanks for watching. You can find all the parts and equipment used in this video over on our website gciron.com.